Hello everyone, Sir Bomber here, and welcome back to an episode of What's New. You know the drill, let's get right into it. Uh, first we have, uh, I'm going to be quick about this one because I got food in the oven and I want to do this before it finishes. Um, yeah, here we go. Uh, we got One Punch Man Volume 12. It's been a very long time since I've read and got more of a volume as One Punch Man, but uh, I wanted to get another one. Uh, oh, I should say I went to the store this time, I didn't actually order it, so I just picked up what I saw. Um, they didn't have Volume 13, so I ended up just getting 12. Um, yeah, One Punch is a great series. I don't know why I've been. I don't know why I've been pausing on it. I should have finished it like a long time ago, but yeah, it is what it is. Up next, we got Goblin Slayer Volume Eleven. Already know, solid series. Up next, we got Mal, uh, Volume Three. Um, a series that's. Uh, I think it's so far after the first two ones. I think it has some promise. I don't have an opinion on it yet, but it has some promise. Up next is a series that is just good. Um, same author, Rumiko Takahashi, Maze Lake Kaku. Love that series. Love it, love it, love it. So good. And I found this there, what I thought was pretty interesting, so I picked it up. It is the H.P. Lovecraft's At the Mountain of Madness, the first volume. Um, I don't know if each one is just an individual short story or if it's whatever, but I picked it up since it's cool. I have a friend who says he really likes it, so I picked it up. Uh, up next we got Crazy Food Truck. This is a newer series that I've been really interested in reading, so I picked it up. Uh, I love post-apocalyptic series, especially when it has a pretty interesting premise. So, yeah. And another new series, a series I've been looking forward to for a while. It is uh, Yokohama Karashikiko. Or, um, I don't know what it is. I don't remember what it is in English. But I'm surprised they just kept the uh, Japanese name. But, yeah, this is a new release by Seven Seas. It's a pretty f it's a pretty fairly big book. It's as big as the uh, Viz uh, ones. And it was actually quite cheap. Well, I mean, Canadian, that's whatever. But, yeah, I'm super excited to uh, read it. Um, my friend, uh, one of my friends, at least, loves this series. He absolutely adores it, so I'm really excited to get into it. But, yeah, that's all for this haul. Um, on another note, I'll be sure to record some more Gungrave maybe later today if I feel like it or if I remember. Uh, yeah, keep an eye out, and maybe there'll be gameplay. Who knows? All right, see you in a bit. Bye.